Hey guys, it's David from Trail Adventures USA. It's Sunday and we just had to get out of the house for a day run. What we're gonna do today is we're gonna set up a really quick day camp. We're gonna do an afternoon cook. We're gonna do some steak, some corn on the cob. We're only a few yards away from Pacific Crest Trail here at Circle Mountain in San Bernardino National Forest. We're gonna share this adventure with you, so stay tuned. It's gonna be a great day. So we got our day camp set up. We got our Covia one action table, front runner chairs. Uh, and Crystal's gonna cut some onions. We're gonna saute some onions. We got the skillets out. We're gonna have some garlic and some uh, thyme, some uh, ribeyes and some corn on the cob. Should be a great afternoon. So we've been preheating our skillets. Crystal's just gonna get her onions on so those can start sauteing. We've got a couple beautiful ribeyes here. Nice size spinalis, not too big. We're just gonna season them with some salt and pepper. We're just gonna throw some salt and pepper on the onions. And same for the steaks. Now, ribeyes can take a lot of salt helps to build that crust, especially if you're cooking on a skillet, cast iron. I like a lot of pepper. And you know what, we'll throw some garlic and paprika as well. A little bit of garlic, not too much, and paprika. Now we'll flip these over and we'll just repeat. Okay guys, so now we're gonna throw these steaks on. Our cast iron is smoking hot. All right. Shouldn't be long now, we'll be enjoying a great lunch. Onions are coming along. All right, stay tuned. So we should have a pretty good crust on the bottom. Oh yeah. I'll just give it a little bit more salt. Now as this second side finishes cooking, we're gonna go ahead and add some butter, garlic, and thyme. What we're gonna do is we're gonna use some of this brown butter now to base the steak. That garlic and that thyme is just really going to infuse these steaks with some flavor. And now the corn is done.
Okay guys, we're gonna cut into this ribeye. Now I didn't bring a thermometer with me up here, so bear with me if it's not perfect, but usually we nail it. I'll just pull this slab up here so we can take a look. Beautiful pink throughout. Yeah. So is that juicy or is that juicy? But let's see how it tastes. Amazing. Mm. Look, if you gotta get away for the day or the afternoon, why not take a good ribeye? Great view. Show them the view, Crystal. We're gonna enjoy some lunch, take a quick break. We'll be back in just a minute. You know, it's humbling. We're only a few minutes from home, honestly. Probably an hour or so. Get to come out here and enjoy a great meal, decompress. And what about that view? Guys, I want to tell you about this new camp table we just got. It's made by Covia. Covia makes a lot of great camping gear. You can find all their stuff on Amazon. I'll put a link in the description. Now, this is not sponsored. We bought this table ourselves. It's about $260 delivered to your door. And what I like about it is that it folds up very easily. Now, we do have other camp tables that we've used, and they could be cumbersome, a little difficult to set up. They take up a weird amount of space in the back of the rig. But overall, this bamboo surface was terrific. Uh, we used it today for the first time, and it, it closes up really simple. The Covia One Action Table comes with a bamboo top with a satin finish. The table is durable and easy to clean. The substructure is made out of polished aluminum and steel, which makes it very durable. The table has three-way adjustable legs for three different size heights. All you do is slide the legs up and you're done. Um, once again, to set it up, it's just a matter of grabbing at the bottom and opening it up. It can't be any simpler than that. You guys should look into it. If you're looking to add a table to your collection, this one I recommend.